Alright, welcome back to the let's Catherine play of Catherine. Why are you even doubting her? I believe in her. Who knows what actually happened? Believe her, but you're ignoring your own sins in the first place. But, but, <laughs> and Vincent, you don't. Huh. Well, if you're cheating, and you think she's cheating, that's the logical choice. <sighs> Dude, I'll just sit there getting angry. I'm not. Sorry. I'm just tired. My head hurts. Maybe I've been playing too much Rapunzel. <laughs> hey, I got the top score on that right now. Once I figured out the trick, they're yeah, pretty fun. You guys really like that game. You don't get why it's so fun, eh, Toby boy? It's me. After I got the hang of it, it's just so addictive. I kind of want to figure out what this puzzle game it, huh? is all about. Everyone I know it's that? like has to do with the nightmares, but I think it's like more of a puzzle than anything. Yeah, you took life one step at a time until you started dating Catherine, didn't you? Uh, shut up already. Alright, I think that's good enough for our talk. Let's talk to our customers. Hey, Archie. What's it, dude? Boss is really annoying. I'm sure you know. He's always telling stupid jokes, but even at work, he sticks God, up. Your eyes look really sucking in. Never asked him to do that. He's a kind man. He's so stupid, though. He doesn't even know that his wife's sleeping around with another man. How are you doing? I ruin things, throw them away, and run away. I'm incapable of love. Something happened? What's your mother like? What? She left when I was in high school. She met another man. Maybe we're the same then. How? We both... We just wanted to love our mothers. Oh. Okay. Let's talk about something else. Don't be so nice to me, and I'll just steal your girlfriend. Get away Psst. from me. I'm gonna leave. Yeah, I, I doubt that's the case. Okay, more text messages. Okay, whatever. Another one? Huh, yeah, whatever. Well, okay, lots and lots of people. Is this the Anna chick that we're talking about? Or, yeah. Let's talk to them. What do you want? Daniel, don't be like that. You're awful kind of Vincent. Why don't you hook up with him? I can't be with you, right? So everyone wins. Yeah, it's no use being with a man who will just become somebody else's. Uh, hey, hey, guys. <sighs> if you're going to get hurt, then why did you bring this up? Do you have any idea how I feel when I buy my clothes? I have to save everything I make just to buy handbags and clothes that won't embarrass you when we're seen together. I studied economics and etiquette every day just so I wouldn't embarrass you at an important dinner. But it's all pointless, because no matter how much I better myself, it'll never be good enough for some people. Anna. Oh, it damn. was inevitable that we break up from the beginning. I'm sorry I never let you give me any presents. I had to do something to keep my dignity. Um, is that it's clear that he was taking advantage this of this poor woman, huh? What we want or don't want. Huh. I guess I'm just not part of this conversation, huh? Okay, Justin, you have any more depressing news? The rest of yesterday's story. Sure, go right ahead. You're up for it. I think I was at the part where the ballerina suddenly had many enemies. She started to be harassed. Eventually, her entire family was killed. What? Oh, Jesus Christ! Just for his fame? After that, it's the truth. I mean, yeah, you're just a mere reporter, if anything, unless you had something to do with it. And but I don't know. I kind of agree with both of them. But I need to make up. Make him happy or something. I don't know. It's done, it's done. That's what everyone else says. But it still won't bring her back. Have I told you about that legend? That if you survive, you'll be granted any one wish. It's just a rumor, right? It might be a ridiculous fairy tale, but right now, I feel like I've got to believe in something if I'm going to go on. If I'd never written that article, she'd still be alive. I know what my wish would be. I'd change the past, save her. I was such a fool. But that's why I'm hung up on this stupid legend. Go ahead and laugh if you like. It's not funny. Yeah, I see why I yeah, would I have so any so I can't afford to reason to laugh at all, so why would you even suggest that in the first place anyways? Oh hey! Policeman! Alright. 
Let's talk to you, sir. Are you drinking? Hey, I've been waiting for you. All right, give it to me, Morgan. I was on duty early today because of the incident. The victims are all men who are younger than me. I feel so bad for those young guys. When someone like me is still alive, do you believe in an afterlife? Uh. Well? Oh, really? If there is an afterlife, that means that death is indeed. I don't know. I like to keep my mind open, but honestly, as an atheist, I really need to find out from the facts rather than just from what I personally believe. I wish it would be nice, but personally for me, like I said, I just, I'm just like the type of person who needs to be convinced in order to, to see. Are you thinking of dying? I'm certainly not good at living. Sorry, but I'm going home. I just came for a little drink before bed. Okay. Uh, oh, depressing thoughts. You got any insightfulness, Erica? Huh? Really? He always looks like that. Did something that? happen? Uh, I don't know. You want me to ask? No, never mind. Probably just me. <sighs> okay. Are you seeing the news? A lot of people are dying. Really? They're blowing it out of proportion. They'll find out what's happening soon. Please tell me someone we know is not dead. I'm a little bit skeptical now. Okay. Let me check the news real quickly. And now, continuing our coverage of the mysterious weakening deaths. Richard Davis, age 30, has been found Okay, we don't know him yet. 30. Wow. It's even younger than I am. <sighs> That's all the updates we have. Okay. After a commercial break. Jesus Christ, Eric, you got me scared for a second. I thought someone in this bar was dead. Not to say that anyone else is dying is a good thing or anything, but still, I don't know. Alright, whatever. Let's talk. Sorry, out, guys. All right, Toby. Hey, how's Toby doing at work? He's fine. I can trust him to customize a bike without watching over him. We should spend more time tinkering with chicks, not bikes. He needs to hook up with somebody good for him. Someone besides Erica. Um. He's so good with the little guy. I don't see why Toby. Like, uh, yeah, Erica is totally out of his league, but I don't know. Like, why is Erica specifically not a good role model for Toby? If I don't know, if they both like each other, then I don't see a reason not to. <laughs> okay, you know what? Maybe you don't deserve Erica at all, dude. Jesus Christ. Um, don't say. Well, why? Why explain this to your mom, though? Uh, okay, yeah, you're clearly infatuated with this Erica chick. Now, but Erica had a lot of problems back in the day. Remember that time she was hurt by a relationship and disappeared? Huh? huh? What happened? <laughs> I remember that. You know, people were saying she was dead, but then she just popped up out of nowhere. I knew Erica had some trauma like that in her past, but I'll fill every hole in her heart. Yeah, I'll fill every hole in her heart. <laughs> serious here. Don't make fun of me. Uh, poor Toby. Alright. Let me drink real quickly. Just to get drunk or something, I don't know. Catherine, who mentioned wasn't her? What's going on here? Just drink my sorrows. Can she actually be cheating? I'd say it's impossible. There's no way. Personally. If I were in. If I were to know Catherine specifically, the fact that she would ever think about cheating would be just complete bafflement. It's said that chugging alcohol isn't good for you, but sometimes it's necessary. Okay. The cocktail Nikolashka is an example of this. It uses cognac, lemon, coffee, and sugar. But first, you put the lemon, coffee, and sugar in your mouth. Then you take a big swig of cognac. Okay. Of course, you can't even talk until you drink it all. It's necessary to chug it. But cognac contains 40% alcohol, so those with low tolerances should not attempt this. Okay. Is the cocktail trivia for tonight. Empty? Erica, I need a drink. You want something else? It's getting pretty late. <laughs> Sake. Sake, please. I'll take a beer. Beer. You got it. Here it is. Hey, Erica. Erica. Oh. Out of the four oh. of us, who would you rather 
the mayor. I thought Vincent would be the guy who'd take the best care of me. Oh damn. Orlando and Johnny don't look like they'd love me. Ding ding ding. Which means you I guess. You're cute and passionate. Yeah, yeah, congrats. You guys jealous? No. Okay, I'm just gonna take a whiz real quickly. Maybe the text messages. Actually, the puzzle game might be a little bit tempting too. But nah, I'll probably save that for like end game or something to figure out what the hell this, all that shenanigans all about. Okay, Wizzy, what's on the phone's agenda right now? Let's see here. Eat your. Eat that piece of cake I gave you, or it's going to get stale. I know you couldn't talk much yesterday. I've been busy with work, and it's hard to make time. I might not be able to pick up the phone sometimes. I'll give you a call soon. Seems a re like a reasonable response, I feel. And Catherine with a C. Oh, it's an image already. Okay. What the fuck is that syringe? <laughs> that better not be like heroin or anything. I'm just a little bit concerned, Catherine. You look hot. I, I there's no questioning that, but uh, you really need to work on your damn personality. I swear to God. Honestly, what the fuck Vincent sees in you, honestly? You're immature, you're a brat, you're spoiled. Why the fuck do people like you? Aside from your hot body? Is it really just because of the hot body? Is that really it? That's bullshit. Here's something that'll make you feel better. Well, is it working? Oh, sorry for saying you're the last one while you were at work. I hope I didn't get you in any trouble. Anyway, take care. This is crossing the line. Nice! Alright. There we go. Honestly, I could just see most of the porn I shit I see in the internet, so... Hey, is it true that you have a tummy egg? You're not lying to me or hiding anything from me, are you? <laughs> That's technically true. Nah. Oh, I'm in the bathroom right now. I I really love that response so much. I don't know why. It's amazing. Hey, right. did something happen? I hope I'm not imagining things. Oh yeah, I'm meeting up with a friend tomorrow. So if you want to call me, do it in the afternoon. After, aren't you busy with work too? Try to take it easy, okay? Yeah, that's... Yeah, we should thank her for at least taking care of us. I think it's... It's nice that she's taking care of us. I'll talk to you later. No. Good night, Catherine. Wish her, like... Wish her good night, good puppy pies. Uh, mysterious meter. I've noticed the meter appears when you... When you... Uh, okay. Vincent's value is always being tested. His state of mind can change the outcome of the plot. The inner monologue he hears when a pinch will be affected too. Pay attention to what he's saying. Okay. Got it. Alright, well, that is that. I, oh yeah, I could wash my face, but I'm not sure exactly what I need to do that for, aside from just... I don't know, a hint as to what's to come next. Anyway, let me drink my sake in peace. Mm. Covering up my own infidelity. I don't have a right to suspect her. Yep, you're, 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 you're learning. You're learning. Mm. It's in slow and steady wins the race, I guess. <laughs> about it. A strange rumor here. Okay, give me. uses many different words and brand names, but the most commonly used is Masamune. 
Why okay. has Shimuning been such a common name since olden times? I don't know, but I'm pretty sure you're gonna tell me. Could be a person's name, but the origin actually does not come from a person. Why would someone name their child Masamune if it's related to sake, though? Sake never found a phrase, Rinzai Seishu. Though spelled differently, Seishu can also mean sake, but the character okay. for Seishu is also read Masamune, and the term stuck. Like the Chinese kanji, or...? Wait, all this history for a lousy pun? <sighs> and that was the... Okay, whatever. Empty. Okay, one more beer. Still want a drink? Yeah. Uh, let's give me a beer. Beer. Sake, please. I'll take a beer. Beer. You guys. <laughs> Johnny's like the only one that's like Here it is. out of the crowd. I'm like willing to like try out anything I want. These guys on the other hand just seem kind of like normies here in terms of beer drinking. Ooh. Catherine, who mentioned wasn't her. What's going on here? Be cheating on me. You're missing the point here, uh, Vincent. It's Catherine with a C might be the one that's lying too. You can't really just focus all your attention on Catherine with a K. She claims that she's not cheating, but you know what? If you're under pressure and you're be confronted that someone is cheating on you, then clearly you're gonna have to say the lie, right? I've been knowing that, but go on. And makes you urinate more, so the calories don't build up, making it hard to get fat. Okay. Yet, sugar is required to break down alcohol, and beer foam makes you hungrier. When these things combine, you get the munchies, and voila, beer belly. Um, I actually haven't been using a lot of sugar inside my beer, so. Beer trivia for tonight. Uh, empty. You still want to drink? I'm good. No, I'm cool. These guys haven't even finished their drink yet. Uh, that's all there is to it, right? This beer or water? I'm not even getting a buzz. Okay. It's really not much. Although I could probably just well, like leave early. Catherine is cheating. You? I don't suspect. Just so you know, you've got the all-time record for smallest heart. You're not looking hard enough. Yeah, I'm pretty sure there's plenty of other people, especially people in this specific venue that's also worse than me. Actually, I haven't talked to uh, the boss yet. Let's try doing that. And when it comes to choosing a partner, the way men see things can't compare to the way women view it. I hear they even distinguish by smell, too. <laughs> I wonder. I can, honestly, I could kind of uh, uh, believe that. For some reason, like, whenever I talk to my girlfriend, she could kind of smell what I smell like. Like, I have, like, a certain distinct smell for, from going, going to her. To say, the hunter in relationships is actually the female. Female moose have males fight each other to win her courtship. When I saw that documentary last night, I was on the edge of tears for the poor husband. Maybe you can't be too careless for too long. Uh, right. Anyway... I have to set things straight to me. Hey, Vincent, I'm going home. Boy, I'll, I'll go with you. Alright. Are you all going yeah. home? You guys be careful, okay? Yeah, this has been a while since I've reason. actually... Everyone seems really tired lately. I, I know, worry. I know. You don't have to worry. I'm not tired at all. What, are you worried about those rumors? You're taking drunk talk way too seriously. Well, <laughs> I hope it's nothing. Have to hope. It's nothing. We'll see y'all later. Okay. <clears throat> so, our next next round in terms of uh, nightmares fuels. Uh, also, are we gonna eat the cake already, dude? It's gonna get stale. You heard Catherine, right? You know Catherine, right? Johnny's always a skeptical type of person, huh? Although it kind of sucks I forgot to save, so... 
That is going to be my downfall, so I'm going to have to pretty much redo the entirety of the bar scene again if I want to, um, in case the game crashes again. Hopefully it's not, because we'll be right back with the next episode of... Actually, all right, before I do anything, I want to... Oh, no, 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 don't do that. I want to make sure we play, like, a cutscene beforehand, and then once we get to the gameplay, that's where we, uh, well, uh, I guess stop for now. It is the sixth day. Tonight's location. Clock tower. Okay. Since ancient times. How high is this tower specifically? Because it seems like we're climbing forever now. Looks like the next stage seven is going to be like various puzzles. Various puzzles. Okay. Oh my god, stage 7 is going to have like four floors. And there's going to be stage 8 too. Jesus Christ, this game's going to take forever. Bomb blocks are lit when you walk over them and will damage nearby blocks. Okay. Bomb blocks are going to be a thing now. So, test out your puzzles. I'm pretty sure like once that happens then that pretty much time. okay. There's still more. Well, we are going to be continuing on forward in the next episode of Catherine. Stay tuned. Until then, 